Fellas, AC here. Welcome to another review. Now today I'm going to talk about an Easy Miyake. I don't think I've reviewed anything from Easy Miyake, although in the 90s, late 90s and early 2000s, Dude Easy Purum was one of my absolute favorite fragrances. I've used it up. I don't have a full bottle. And after a long, long time, I got myself a sample of a new Izumiyaki, Izumiyaki Lyudizi Purong Solar Lavender. This came out this year, 2024, and they've been doing some fragrances, good work as well, but I haven't had a chance to sample them. This is the first Izumiyaki flanker that I'm trying, and I must admit, I quite enjoyed it. Ooh, hmm. So, a little about Izumiyaki. Izumiyaki, Lodisi, I should say, was Jacques Cavalier's masterful creation. It had yuzu with spices, florals, this is strong, and cedar, right? And it had this amazing master peel. It had a brilliant um, sort of a scent profile, which was very, very, um, adaptable to occasions. For example, you could wear it to work, to clubbing. Women loved it. It was a brilliant a sort of a um, compliment magnet. You know, you could throw anything at it. Even now, I don't have a bottle. I'm sure it is light even now. I've seen a lot of reviewers still like it. Izumiyaki Solar Lavender. Let's see. So, there are three or four flankers now. So one is the Lodisi, there's the cedar version. I'll put up a, a picture, this is very strong. Uh, I'll put up a picture for you to have a look. So there is cedar, there is vetiver, and now there is lavender. And the reason this is so strong is because of Sichuan pepper. It's, and ambroxan, a lot of ambroxan. So the original one had cedar, I saw you super. This has got a lot of ambroxan. And you get the original Izumiyaki. I'm just, I'm, the memories come flooding in. It's just beautiful, um, woody, floral yuzu, you know, um, sort of um, citruses, but mixed with Sichuan pepper. Enjoying it. And there's also a little hint of um, aquatics, almost like one portion of Aqua de Gio and three portions of Ludizi with Sichuan pepper. I enjoy this. This is a great opening. From memory, when in about 15 minutes time, you will get lavender and a nice lavender. The lavender smells like, it's very sunny, sort of hazy, bright lavender. It does not, this pepper, it, it does not smell like, um, let's say, a, a barbershop fragrance. It does not smell like a department store cleaning product. It is a nice soapy herbal lavender, which is quite sunny and bright. And then the Sichuan pepper goes back and what comes to the fore is a very creamy cedar, very creamy cedar, very nice, bright, Lavender, very, very affable, very likable, with the original Izumiyaki DNA. This pepper is really bothering me. <laughs> I also went uh, four sprays on this little tiny decant or sample, and it's really pumping out. And as you all know, I've got a very sensitive gag reflex, especially towards smells like, whoa, uh, pepper. So. Anyways, um, that's the scent profile. So it becomes more creamy, more woody, with a bright lavender, and the original is Miyake DNA, which is basically a citrus aromatic on a floral woody base. That's the scent, you know? Nothing complicated, but very, very nice, very likable. So, pros and cons, if I can bear to keep this pepper away from me. A lot of pepper, especially if you go heavy. Um, 
upsides and downsides. This is a very likable, very nice and easy to wear fragrance. Unless you have a very sensitive gag reflex like me. Excellent, excellent, very likable fragrance, very easy to wear. That's the biggest plus point of this fragrance, the biggest one. It's so likable and so comforting, so relaxing. It's just fantastic and easy to wear. That's the biggest one, compliment factor. The fragrance will get you a compliment, for sure. Reason, so likable, so easy to wear, so easy to understand. There's no complexity, no oddity, there's, there's no odd notes here, apart from that pepper, which is bothering me. Um, it's such a likable fragrance. You will definitely get a compliment if you wear it the right way. So what is the right way to wear it? We'll come to that downside performance. This thing becomes a skin set, not now at least, a skin set in about two and a half, three hours. And then longevity is about six hours. So you will not get a full day's work, uh, sorry, wear out of this. For some reason, this pepper is just blowing out of my skin and it's really bothering me. But you will not get a full day's wear out of this fragrance because it becomes a skin scent and then slowly it just goes into uh, territory where you think, am I wearing something? Is there anything that I've worn today? That sort of thing, it almost disappears from your skin. That's the biggest downside. Is there anything else I can think of? I can't think of any other downside. I mean, it's just so simple. There are many fragrances in this category. Ambroxan, lavender, citrus aromatic, the many fragrances. So there's nothing special. I mean, a thought did cross my mind that Izumiyaki probably have missed a trick here. Uh, they're doing so many nice flankers or so many flankers. Why, why not do something which really ups the game and brings Ludisi or Izumiyaki into the mainstream where people just start screaming and ranting and raving about it. They've missed an opportunity here. It's just too safe, too safe. So age groups, it's a very easy to wear fragrance. It's one of those fragrances that doesn't demand anything of you. The lavender isn't um, going to be something which will uh, be like um, an old man's fragrance. No, it is a very modernized fragrance. Anybody can wear this. Okay, so age groups, I would say, uh, since it's lavender, since it's Izumiyaki, which is reminiscent of a 90s fragrance, uh, 30 plus, if you want to play safe. Uh, occasions, where to wear this, daytime, autumn, spring. It has lavender, you know, lavender shines with cedar in spring and autumn. It's a very nice dry down, very nice. Um, autumn and spring, right season to wear it. Um, places to wear it, where do you wear it? It's a great office scent. It wouldn't offend anybody. It smells clean, nice, soapy, very warm, very likable, very affable, easy to get along, easy to approach. Work scent, fantastic. Or if you've got a short engagement outdoors, um, like a daytime date scenario, meeting with your friends, going shopping, going to the gym, that sort of thing. You really don't have to think about it. Just spray a couple and then move. Maybe not a couple, more than a couple. But that pepper, if as I said, can bother you, may bother you. Um, Compliment fact, definitely. It's a clean, likable, affable, approachable, relaxing fragrance. The lavender is wonderful. Compliment, absolutely, no doubts. And the pepper has calmed down, thank God for that, because it was really bothering me. Um, I think I've covered all aspects. Okay, value for money. It's just come out, right? So prices are gonna be high. If you're paying more than 40 pounds for 100 ml or 50 pounds push, you're doing it wrong because Izumiyakis get uh, to the discounters and they become very affordable. These are affordable fragrances. There's nothing complex about it. Performance can be a little bit of a letdown, but you should be able to get it for less than 50 pounds or just about 50 pounds. If you're doing more than 50 pounds, probably not, not worth it. Uh, so value for money at the moment is low, but once it gets to the discounters, once you can get to it in the bracket I mentioned, it should be a medium to high kind of a fragrance where you can wear it, uh, where you don't really want to put an effort into thinking too much 
and also it wouldn't offend anybody and the positive is you will get a compliment so how many marks am i going to give it see this is a fragrance which falls in the category where there are many right you have to love ambroxan you have to love cedar creamy cedar you have to really like lavender and that to modernize lavender and then you, i think you'll really enjoy this fragrance so overall based on the fact that this doesn't have the kind of performance you would expect from a good you know izumiyaki fragrance and projection and longevity i'm going to give it a six out of ten six out of ten i hope it's a fair marks for a nice fragrance relaxing lovely fragrance unfortunately the performance is a bit of a letdown hope you enjoy the review fellas take care bye bye